for the rest of his life. We are taking a live look now at what looks like a postcard, but that is actually St. Mark's, just a short drive from wherever you are in our coverage area right now. And she would tell us how it feels underneath that picturesque sky is first to know meteorologist Alexa Trishler. Alexa, good morning. Good morning, Cara. It is chilly outside, but it is wonderful. Can't get a better look than that. Plenty of sunshine on the way today, and it's going to be comfortable too. Rain free for several days until later this upcoming work week. So get in on the enjoyment now. Clear skies through the morning, through the day. Not much to talk about, but there is one thing to keep in mind. We do have a moderate fire risk because it's going to be so dry. We're going to be so comfortable thanks to low humidity, but we're going to have a lot of sunshine and strong winds this afternoon, so fires could spread easily. I would definitely say avoid doing any outdoor birding, especially in South Georgia. Spots that haven't seen that much rain, but everywhere you go today, try to keep the burning to not happening. It's going to be warm this afternoon. High temperatures will be warming up nicely to the low 70s. Gorgeous day, 71 in Bainbridge, 74 in Tallahassee. Hopefully you can get outside and take advantage of this wonderful weather. If you don't have time today, tomorrow's going to be another great one. It is going to be windy through our afternoon hours. Winds will be mostly out of the west northwest, giving us a refreshing cool feel. But it looks like gusts could be over 20 miles per hour at times. Winds should calm down later tonight under clear skies will get kind of chilly going into Sunday morning. Low temperatures will be dropping down to the low to mid 40. So that's jacket weather early Sunday, but will warm up right again. High pressure will give us a quiet trend. No rain expected through the weekend and early this week. We'll see a warm up to I mean a major warm up with winds turning mostly out of the south early this week giving us also a moistening trend, but we stay dry. You'll just notice a little bit more moisture in the air, so it'll start to feel a little humid this week. It's going to get breezy throughout Wednesday, and then a strong cold front will slide through Thursday, producing some strong storms, which we do have to keep an eye on. We might stay wet even into Friday. So the seven day looks absolutely wonderful until we hit late this week, Thursday and Friday. We've got much more coming up after the break, so stick around.